Olive. So today we are going to draw a unicorn, unicorn mermaid. So let's start by doing the horn. You know what? That actually do that. Um. So we could do something like this. We could do like that. We'll do like the face of it. Do that and then keep going. Keep going. And we go a little in front. And oops. And next we are going to do the line right here. And around. Wow, that looks pretty good. I'm sure you yours looks even better. Okay, so next, let's do in China. Look what we should do next. No, let's do the belly. Alright, so let's do it like a fine way, like that. Shoo, shoo. Shoo, little fly. Little fly right next to me. And next, how about we do that right there? Just because you might be a little like you might you might be no you might not like follow up with me. So I'm gonna give you one minute to finish this if you're um, behind. Okay, now we're going to move on to the horn. So let's go all the way up to there. Next, we should go all the way to there. See, it kind of looks, looks like a narwhal. The horn kind of looks like a narwhal. So let's do this. For, this is like the belly part. I don't know if you know, but I believe that unicorns are real. Do you? Sarah Luna, if you're watching this, I believe that you know they're alive. I, I just know. You're a creative girl. You know what to do sometimes. But sometimes you're the best girl in the world. I bet your mom would be so will be so surprised when you show this to her. I think she's going to be like, "Where did you learn that from?" And then she said, "Oh, I learned it from my bestie." And that bestie will be me. But I'm sure you have another bestie that will help you. This Let's just put this like that. Good job, so you can see it. So this is what it looks like if it's upside down. That's kind of weird. But if we do it like this way, it's much better to see. Right? Right. Next, let's do some bubbles. Some bubble. Alright. First, let's do a small bubble. And then we'll do a kind of bigger bubble, and we'll do a ginormous bubble, and then on top, we'll do a ginormous bubble, and then we'll start coming, and then maybe we should, should do another bubble. If you want to add more, go ahead and do that. Like if you want to do one like right over here, you can do that, you can do that. You can do whatever you want, you're creative. Not me, not me, definitely not me. <laughs> And you're going to put your eyes like that, and you're going to fill that in. So it's kind of like staring at you. It's staring at you. You. I'm not going to kill you, actually. And then we do the smile. Little curve. 
Next, we'll do one of the nostrils. Let's see. Let's do that one, that one, that one, that one, and even bigger. <laughs> All right, that. And next, let's do maybe that. So that's what it looks like so far. <laughs> the ears look a little bit better, but no, no rush, no rush, no rush, no rush. Next, if you want to color, you can color. Get over here. All right, I'll put my regular Sharpie away, you know. Right. I'm so sorry if it makes that noise. I'm so sorry. We got this from Taria, actually. And I feel like I'm gonna really <laughs> give you a Should I use this for the body? I think I should. It looks. Oh gosh, this was a really bad idea. But okay, let's go for it. It's probably gonna take kind of a long time for me to. But if you, if you want your um. Mer mermaid to be like in the ocean or on land you could add like some plants or maybe some people if it's on land or you could like make it see a boat because its head just popped out of the um ocean just to take a breath or maybe just see the open world I bet you guys like the open world. I bet you're such in love that you would marry it. <laughs> All right, so we're still coloring, and or maybe you're just watching. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, and we'll keep doing this until until we are done with this. And we'll move on to this. We'll move on to that. Do you think that looks good, you guys? Here, let me put it a little higher. There we go. That's what it looks like. Looks so nice. Or, oh, you know what? That's a race. That it looks looks a little bad. That's a race. <laughs> I bet yours looks even better. Now, there's a couple lines that maybe are different to you, but if Sarah Luna or even um, Sarah Luna, if you don't know what diagonal means, it means like your paper is like this. I don't remember the word, but sometimes like this. Go over, little brown fly. I hate flies when they come over. In fact, have you ever been stung by a wasp? I have. I'm too scared to even go outside. Like, if I saw a wasp, I would totally go in the water. <laughs> I would jump in the water with, like, scared eyes, staring at it. And then I would probably just jump in, no matter if I have floaties or not. I'm sorry, babe. You want to keep coloring? Yes. Keep coloring, okay? Go, little fly. I hate flies. Get out of here. <sighs> okay. So, I'm going to ask you another... I'm going to ask you another question. Have you ever watched RuPaul before? Probably most of you don't know even RuPaul is. RuPaul's are boy people. Boy people that get into makeup. I know, it's kind of crazy. But if you're a girl, you might put on makeup. Like my friend Caitlin 
Probably some of you know Caitlyn. She's the one with the blonde hair. She's pretty nice. She's the one that had like. She's the one that um. That. That like has a lot of cool stuff, but maybe you have a little more cool stuff in there. I don't know. I don't know. I really, really, really don't know. I don't. Next, I'm going to use. No, you know what I'm gonna use blue for one of the tops. I'm gonna make the top rainbow, but I'm doing a different kind of rainbow. I'm also gonna use a neon. If you don't know what a neon, a neon is like a lighter color, which that lighter, that lighter color will help me. <laughs> Let's do that. I want to make it like right, like nice. <laughs> um, should not change with that color. Something. There we go. I'll make extra line. And then I'll get this really light color and I'll use it on there. Next color we should get a green. Yes, why didn't why didn't um I think that this is another neon you can see. Neon is spelt N O N E O N. I know, it's weird. It's kind of weird how it sounds, but some people, I bet, like, do it N-E-E-N. <laughs> and then maybe, oh, let's do it here. If you want to know how to draw, if you want to know how to do neon, it's spelled, let's see, where's the neon one? This is a neon yellow. This is how you spell it. I'll do something to my paper just because. That's how you spell. Here, let me just put a little. Oh my gosh. Um, so, um, I'm going to do this color, and next I'm going to do a, what color should I use? No, I'm going to use this color. I think it's another neon. Yep, it's definitely another neon. Next, I'm going to get a one of these pinks. Next, I'm going to do this color. There is thing next. I kind of want to do this. I'm super sorry, friends. These are the two colors I'm using for the horn. My mom came in the room for some reason. Sure? No. Positive? Yeah. Okay. 
Are you almost done? Yeah. Why do you ask? I don't know. I'm just curious. Now, you want to keep going? Yes. Okay, maybe I'll speed up this part then. Alright. And then we're done with the horn. So that's what my unicorn looks like so far. Now, no, I know what color it is. I'm kind I'm very sorry that noise. I don't know why he does that. I thought it was going to be perfect, but it's not very perfect anymore. That's my thing, and then next, I'm going to be doing another reveal. So these are one of my thick markers. You can see what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. And I'm going to be carefully doing this. I'm not going to do it in like shades like I did up here, here. My mom keeps staring at me at the door. So I say, go. I'm not, anyways, I'm not doing a shade like that. I'm not doing color shades. I'm doing it like right Rainbow. Just checking if my mom's at the door staring at me. Mom, you better not laugh. Sorry, friends. I have no thick um, yellow ones, so I'm just using the thin one. I am sorry, friends. I'm so sorry. Sorry, friends. I'm gonna make the bubbles. Sorry again. And then I ooh, kind of want to do this. I'm using almost the thick markers. Using some neon ones. Itchy, itchy, and itch my nose.
I didn't get um I didn't get every color of the rainbow neon. I didn't get every color of them. No! Stop staring at me! I'm trying to learn how to draw a unicorn, mermaid. No, you were not. You don't even have paper. Oh, oh, this is a new one. I did not notice. So that is what my mermaid looks like. I'm just gonna make sure you get a closer, closer look. If you did something different, that's that is totally fine with me. But if you did something the same or part of the same. You're all right with that. Bye. I hope you learn from me.